Sandy says, every one of your live talks and videos have given me a new perspective on life. For this, I'm forever grateful. Thank you so much. You're quite welcome, Sandy. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Angie says, 41 from Arizona. My name is Angie. I have been watching all of your videos. Not possible, Angie. It's about a thousand videos. <laughs> and really taking in the information and it has helped me incredibly with family, new friends, relationships. Delighted to hear that, Angie. Angie, don't forget, we need you. We need you to share the videos that you like in social media. We need you to go on the videos that, uh, uh, specifically the one that I say, I ask in there. It's, it, it, the title is, has this channel been helpful to you? Find that video, go there, like it, and make a comment. That'll help us because when new people want to join us and subscribe to us, that would be a helpful one if I put it as an introductory video for them to see how many people actually say that they've been helped uh, by this channel. So that would encourage them to also join us because we need to be uh, present on YouTube. We need to be recognized. We're still found accidentally and we're trying to do our best to move on and grow. So we need everybody's help. If you are listening to this, whoever you are, wherever you are, and rerun or live, please do go on that video. Has this channel been helpful to you? And then click and make a comment and uh, that would be helping the channel as well. Mimi Kaya says, Mehran, how would you describe a toxic person? Well, a person who's had too many drinks. <laughs> that would be a toxic person and many other kinds. <laughs> when my ex broke up, she said I was toxic. Well, you know, just, everybody says that when they want to have an upper hand and they can't make it work or for some reason they want to break up. So they say, you know, uh, you were toxic. They never said they are toxic or the relationship was toxic or it wasn't working. They want to blame somebody. That's the nature of human being. Wants to escape from responsibility. And we just had a one... Um, let me, uh, please don't come in. Please, 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 please. The bee, the bee, the bee, the bee. Okay, thank you. God bless. <laughs> That's a big bee. Uh, so uh, they don't want to take responsibility. And just, uh, was it, um, there's a video I've come up with uh, just, uh, I guess, a week ago or so. It says, uh, uh, I think, it was just yesterday or something, and it's called The Love of Your Life, Do You Know Her? So The Love of Your Life, Do You Know Her? Just a day ago, I think I put it on. And it's a very interesting one that helps you to take responsibility or at least uh, everybody sees where the responsibility for the breakup is. Um, and I think especially, uh, I'm just discussing in that video from a men's point of view, because this channel was originally made for uh, men as a support to men and from men's point of view. But anybody who's watching it, you can switch it around and just get the uh, gist of it, j get the concept and uh, just switch it for uh, to, to suit uh, the kind of relationship that you may be having. So he continues and says, um, she said that I was toxic and what if I'm toxic, but I didn't see it. How to stop being toxic, egoistic, and narcissist. Well, Mimi, if that is something that you um, suspect, well, of course, you can make an appointment and we can explore it together and see what are the steps you took, what are the actions and reactions you had, and we can uh, discuss also what does make a good behavior for a man in a relationship. And then uh, together we can explore and bring to your attention the things that you were doing, why it would be toxic, if it is, because I don't know anything about it. And um, was she actually uh, right or was she just simply giving you a line? And uh, we will go through it and find the truth of it between you and I, and then we'll help you to see it and then create a standard for yourself, which would be much higher standard, uh, that would um, present you um, and be coming to you and present you better 
in better version of yourself to yourself in your own mind and then reflection of it to the society and to the people that you meet. So for that, you can go to my site, mindthatseekstruth.com and make an appointment with a talk to me for consultation button. You can push that and you'll have different packages. And until further notice, <laughs> uh, for a short time, uh, as long as I can make it work, anybody who makes an appointment of 15 minutes or 30 minutes or one hour up to this one hour, you'll get double. A 15 minutes appointment will give you 30, 30 minutes will give you one hour and the one hour will give you anywhere from one and a half to two hours depending on where our conversation is um, but there are other packages that are very inexpensive when you go higher it just becomes very inexpensive as well however uh, so you can do that and anybody else who would like to discuss with me on anything you can do uh, go on the site and make an appointment and we'll explore it together uh, Angie says what kind of tea today well Angie this is actually has become my favorite tea lately Mm. it's raspberry pomegranate and I think hibiscus and some of the stuff that I don't remember but it's very balanced very pleasant not sour not sweet it's just I think perfectly balanced <laughs> I think it's uh, twining it's a tea bag I'm surprised to have found such a good balance in one of these packages uh, but it's all herbal and no garbage in it at least not that I can tell <laughs> it's it's very tasty I like it and apparently it's good for you too you know raspberry and pomegranate and all that's great for you 